Hi guys, it's Soft Dog and the group performance is nearly over. Oh, we nearly finished rehearsals, yay! I think the day is all I need. This is part of the script. Fabulous highlighting skills. I think I'm multiple but I prefer to do it. I have a massive bag. Rosie! And then I've got the whole cutlery. No! Okay, yeah. And then I've got costumes. Crazy. Oh no. Here, yeah, it's gonna have texture on. Lovely. Oh, oh, what time? Yes. 4.35. Round of applause, everyone. Filming this brilliant bag. Just go ahead. We are home, guys, and that video performance is just a little sneak peek of some of my drama people. Yeah, we're just gonna get on with it. Yeah, we're 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 gonna get on with it. My hoodie and those striped socks again because I can't find um, proper leg warmers, so I'll wear those because my character's from the 1987. I know she's from America and she might not wear those, but I thought that's going to be the costume and these, so it's not going to be too different from what I wear. Got my dessert because I've literally just come home, had dinner, and then. We need to practice my morg, but I'll do it after dessert because I don't need a break. But I feel like I need to get the group piece out of my head and focus on the morg. Now I went into Poundland before I got home and got these. I think they're the same nerds as what I usually get, just different packaging. I don't know. Maybe they're slightly different. And I found this weird. Meerkats sweets. I think they're jelly sweets. So weird. And produced in Belgium. So Holland. So they might be Holland sweets. I don't know. If you if you yeah, if they uh have these sweets anywhere else and if you live there, just comment down below. I know it's weird but they don't give you much information apart from natural colours and flavours. Which is total opposite to them. I'm not going to do but usually sweets we have, they say what they are on the front. We can obviously see what they are but our company like to just point it out at the front. It makes it a lot easier. So are they going to be like jelly babies or are they going to be like proper jelly like basset right jelly. i am so back we'll and we are ready for this taste test it's going to be part of the vlog again i'm glad i'm feeling better so i can taste these sweets so i showed you them earlier but just in case for some reason in the past minute you forgot we've got some meerkats but it's literally the name of the sweets we've literally got no other information we're showing what they look like look like what they look like at the front but apart from that we don't really have Okay. Oh, these are these are big. These are big. Okay, let's try these two. You've got like a literally full flavour. I'm gonna call it. These are pretty cool moulds, though. You can smell them really. And they sort of got a half dip, so we're gonna try this one first. I assume this is orange. I'm gonna snap it in two because of how big it is. So I assume this is the orange one. Um, it's okay. It's not amazing. It's edible, and I've dropped it. Um, I mean, mm -hmm. you can definitely tell this is a natural flavor. It's not artificial. Um. It's just a tiny bit of orange. Um, doesn't taste too much like orange. Um, I assume that's flavour. I have no idea if that's flavour. It might be peach, maybe. People get more adventurous with their flavours. Um, I'm going to try and eat this one whole. Mm -hmm. It's really sticky. Really 
Okay, it's drinking. Yeah. I mean, I can taste the orange in this one more. I can't really taste much lemon in it, which again, I, I assume is flavour, maybe? We don't get much clues. But it's, even though it's naturally flavoured, I can sort of, at the end, still taste. But, you know with cheaper sweets, you've got that cheap sweet taste, which is a really weird way of saying it. But, it's like with the... I can't remember what sweets it was. It was, it was some sweets. Like at the very, oh, with the jelly beans. At the very end, you sort of just taste... Like for this, I at the end, I just taste normal gelatin, no flavour. Um, so it doesn't end on a good note. It doesn't finish with a big flavour. It sort of just goes down. Which sounds really weird, but... With sweets, like sweet tarts, they continue the flavour on and on until the very end, even um, when it's very small. So that's what I'm trying to say. Um, but they just sort of taste like normal gummy sweets. They're sort of halfway in between gummies, like the really soft ones and then the really chewy ones. Like they don't taste like the Bassets with the really strong flavour but they've got the texture but then they've got the flavour of the more squishy ones. So it's sort of like combo them both. Um, they're nice. I mean, the flavour's a bit weak, but they're nothing special. They're, uh, they're okay, I'll probably eat all of them, but I wouldn't say they're anything special. But I thought I'd just try those two flavours. I only noticed the double dipped ones when I got the orange one out. But at least they're trying to change it up a bit. At least they got double dipped. And we've still got all this to eat. They're very big sweets as well, very big, you have to eat them in twos or three. So I hope you have enjoyed that, that was just a quick taste test and I've still got some in my mouth. Um, <laughs> I hope you guys don't see that. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go practice my monologue um, once or twice with Felix and then I'll be back after. See you guys later. Oh no, I've started eating the nerds. Uh oh, I still need to throw those away. <laughs> On that. So I managed to do my monologue a couple times. It did feel quite quick, I must admit. Um, it went really quick, so I might slow it down a bit tomorrow, not too much. But I am feeling nervous about tomorrow because, I mean, even though the group performance, there's a lot more going on, I'm not as nervous as the group performance because it's a group performance. Um, no, it's, I personally find it more fun, uh, it might be more difficult to rehearse, but I guess it feels there's not as much pressure because you're in a group and if one of you messes up then, yeah, it might affect the rest of the group, but it's not the end of the world, whereas if you mess up on your monologue, then uh, you're not screwed because you can easily um, bring yourself back and do it again, but... No, I'll be okay because, no, I'll be okay. So, I was watching some YouTube as well. Yesterday I filmed with my phone, which was no problem, but I did find it a bit difficult transferring the videos. Transferring. And we've ordered some more felt for the art exam. Oh yeah, that's something I wanted to tell you. Um, I got my up feedback today after the art exam. My points, it's out of... 75 or 85 now I got 53 which is not too bad um so I was like okay I've done some more work after that I'm sure that's worth a few points I get the feedback today and also combining my final piece it's the exact same score and I admit I'm a bit confused because I thought um the extra work I'd done after the feedback for this one would have been enough but apparently not or if I have gained more points and my final piece has lowered it I don't know and what is frustrating is not really frustrating but one of the girls in our class she's really good at art but what she made was definitely not her best piece of work 
But apparently she still really liked it. And chocolate, give a chocolate uh, finish. Bit confusing. Oh, no time but no, that's just life. I am going to try and blow her away if she doesn't like what I do. I'm just going to try my best and if my best isn't enough for her then that's it. I'm just going to keep on practicing and maybe prove her wrong one day. Even though she seems pretty happy with my work but yeah so I'll just end on that note. The nerd sweet air eating hasn't stopped. I can't help it. Uh, <laughs> so that was very random, very random. Um, it's nearly nine o'clock. I'm going to end vlog here. I hope you enjoyed it. Not much happened, but as I said, I knew it was going to be a busy week, especially tomorrow with the monologue. I'm doing fine. I think once the monologue's out the way, I'll be pretty happy because of the group performance. I think I am going to enjoy it more than my monologue but I'm going to do it so I'll see you guys tomorrow whether it will be after the monologue or before